what you'll need. 1. An Apple Silicon Mac running one of the following Mac OS and logged in with an admin account. 2. A Thunderbolt 4 blank external SSD drive and it's formatted with the following settings using disk utility. Name EXT Macintosh HD or whatever name you like and format APFS as shown. 3. Have a copy of macOS Sonoma and that is located in the Applications folder. Now, simply launch the macOS Sonoma installer from the Applications folder and click on Show All Disk button. Select the external SSD drive named EXT Macintosh HD, then the Continue button as shown. Next, choose an admin owner for this volume if you have more than one. I'll select Mac Studio A. You're then given the option to copy account settings from Mac Studio A. If the box is unchecked, this will perform a clean install of macOS Sonoma instead. I'll do just that and uncheck the box to perform a clean install. Now click the install button and after entering your admin password, the installation of macOS Sonoma on the external SSD drive will begin. I'll just time lapse the installation process from here, which in my case actually took about 12 minutes to complete. After the installation process is finished, I'll just time lapse the on screen installation instructions where you'll be brought to the macOS Sonoma desktop. It's now advisable to change the startup drive order of your Mac because the installation process of macOS Sonoma has made the external SSD drive the default startup drive. To change this, simply open System Settings, click General, then on Startup Disk. Now, select the Macintosh HD as the default startup drive and after entering your admin password and then click the Restart button. As you'll notice, whenever you restart or turn on your Mac, the Macintosh HD drive will be used to start up your computer. However, anytime you want to start up your Mac from the EXT Macintosh HD drive with macOS Sonoma, simply plug the external Thunderbolt 4 SSD drive into your Apple Silicon Mac if it's not already plugged in. Next, turn on the Mac and continue to hold the power button until the startup options window appears. Select the EXT Macintosh HD drive, then click continue. As shown, the EXT Macintosh HD drive with macOS Sonoma is used to start up your computer. And that's all there is to it. Thanks for watching, thumbs up if you liked this episode, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so, and don't forget to hit that bell icon to be notified of the next upcoming episode. Peace!